Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to modify sounds in Baldi's Basics. Okay. Okay, but what you need to install, we're going to have to install Unity X and Notepad++. But if you have Notepad, you don't need to install that second application I said in that order. And what you also need to install Unity Assets Bundle Extractor. But if you already have it, you don't need to install that. I'll, I'll give the link in the description if if you saw if you see this tutorial first. Anyway, let's get started. So. We'll have to install Unity X for s from somewhere in YouTube or something. Okay. Or I can just Unity X. Oops, I did not in the DX. Unity X, not in the DX. Okay, Unity X. Search that up. Never mind, we only have to... We probably only have to go to here. What? The scripts? That's not where we're supposed to go to. You know what? Never mind. I'll give the link to the description for the new Unity X download. For now, I'll make a folder of Unity X. Just hold on for a sec. Oops. This is what I saw inside the app. Icon. It's the main icon, but I'll not, like, give it to you because I know how to extract it, but... I taught you how to extract in the description of the first tutorial before the last the tutorial before the last tutorial. If you saw the description different this time before the last time, well that's because I forgot to explain it in that tutorial. Sorry about that. But the new updated description of that tutorial is now fixed. So this way you can extract it. Anyway. I copy this.
he went to get the sound from the <laughs> from the from the actual shared assets to dot assets folder. No, not folder. File. Then and you'll have to follow what I do. Okay. We open up UABE. I'm doing the 1.3.2 version again. The last tutorial we did the 1.2.2 version. At the final result, I was going to make a new mod called All These Purple Basics. Okay. For example, I'm going to be doing MUS underscore learn. No, I'll just do B A L underscore high, where he says hi to you. Export the sound. Now I need to tell you look carefully. Remove this dash with shared assets to dot assets and the numbers of the of the path ID. Remove that. Save it in here. This one is a lot easier than other people's tutorials, but those ones are a little harder. I wasn't able to figure it out, but now I know this one. Let's just okay. But Audacity will be in its description to download. Okay, I'm gonna record mine. Recording elephant hit test. Testing test test one two three. Now you need to replace it in here. Okay, I need to make a cut. All right, sorry about that. Do not save this because it will count as an Audacity project. Hmm. Uh. Hmm. Now we open up Unity X. 
Open Archive Unity. Now we pick our folder. Now, look carefully. You need to look for the exact audio clip you extracted and edited and re or replaced the new one with. Or you could just search it up right away. Item select. Okay. You export with convert. Select that. If you don't get file extensions, use WinRAR. I recommend it being FSB for the final name extension for the file. But you go into here. Name the file extension to 2 as dot S and D dot F S B because that was the final result of how the thing was extracted. Those exported with a convert. Anyway, you open it back up. No, you open it. No, you open it back up. Um, open the folder back up. Okay, it was behind the actual thing. Okay, copy this. Now, it shows you unity underscore assets underscore files. If you extract something with the convert of that dot assets file, I'm going to replace the found destination and next. We open it back up. Oops, no, 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 no. Okay. Open Archive Unity. All right. Only 1.3.2 data and shared assets too. This time you do not select the asset. This time you import all files. It saves automatically, but it doesn't create a copy. So you could just exit out of it. And you can test to see if it works. If you don't want your files to be exposed, delete this folder right away. And permanently, and permanently delete it from the recycle bin. Permanently. It's the recycle bin. And... Okay. Now let's test the game. Basics in education and learning. That's me.
Recording elephant hit test. Testing test test one two three. It worked. The reason why I'm at a different position because I edited the player's um transform transform co component and the script. I was probably not supposed to do it, but I had to do that. In but I did that anyway. But hey, it worked. Well, guys, that's it for the tutorial. Thanks you. Th <laughs> thank you so much for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Don't forget, don't forget to hit the like on the video and subscribe to the channel. Goodbye.